everyone, this is Yuruki. Yes, it's rare that I do a voiceover for my video, and it's going to be for the whole video. But I have a lot to say, and well, I'm too lazy to write it all, honestly. <laughs> for this review, I'll check out the three new cottage models in depth. Make sure to watch until the end because I've discovered some very interesting things. You'll want to know this so you can compete at the start of Arcage Unchained. So first up, let's compare the new model's exterior look. The exterior of these houses are all very distinctive and bright. They all stand out amongst older house models. The best part of these houses are their lovely detailed doors that are actually 3D modeled compared to the usual flat images that look 3D. Their chimneys are also gorgeous to look at and are all unique. I feel like the most distinctive model is by far the Tudor Slate with its blue and yellow theme. Unfortunately, it's also the model I dislike most because of its broken slate walls. The most detailed model of the three is the Rustic Rose by far. The pink may not work for everyone's taste, but its gorgeous exterior trims make it the most interesting model. The Springstone is the blendest house, but also the most cohesive. The colors work well together, and its roof has the most upkept look of all three. It would be the best model if it had a more detailed door on par with the other two. Unfortunately, all three models have the same interior look. That being said, this new look is absolutely great even without UCC. This new detailed fireplace is stunning and will work with most decor looks. The beams also have a better texture and a nice neutral wood coloring that won't ruin your UCC decor. I won't focus on the walls, floors and ceiling because those can be easily replaced with whatever you like. Now let's get into the fun glitches to maximize your space. I first tested the attic glitch. As with all cottages, it works flawlessly. The attic in those models has a full empty space that lets you place furniture. It has a bit more room than the older cottage models, which is good. There's no issues with the glitch like slippery floors or ghost areas. If you don't know what those are, try to make an attic in an upgraded cottage or in a townhouse. I'm very disappointed by the lack of visible floor that made the older model feel like an immersive attic. The next glitch is the basement of the house. I've tested three different heights to see how the basement works with those models. You should adjust the basement height based on your character model height if you want to be able to walk in freely. Previously, most houses have been found to have an accessible basement. You could use it to put yard furniture and trade packs. These three cottage models are the first to have an area in the basement where you can farm. You can place crops, animals, and trees in the back half of the basement. You can look at the beams to measure the area available to farm. The height of your basement will restrict the placement of certain animals or trees. If your basement is at least dwarf height, you're good to place anything. This new feature will make those new models much more desirable at the launch of Arcade Unchained. Let's have a look at just how much farming you can do compared to someone who isn't using this house model. On those new cottages, you can easily plant 10 small trees. We're talking about trees like apple, lemon, and cedar. Possibly even more if you're better than me at planting, which isn't difficult. 
With those trees, you can plant up to 55 crops that are the same size as rice. I was only able to plant 54 in the video because I've messed up. I'm sure a few people will wonder why it matters as a 16 by 16 farm will always be better. Well, having a house in Arcage makes you a resident of that area, which gets you a lot of benefits and lets you interact with additional community center features. Additionally, you can use the fireplace to create a new teleport location to the house. By using these new house models, you'll maximize your land, which will give you an advantage in your start of Arcage Unchained. Thank you for watching. Please like the video and don't forget to subscribe if you love Arcage housing just like me. I'll see you in the next video. Bye!